What's up you guys? It's Michelle here. Thanks for joining me today and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing my classic spread for next week, so stay tuned for a fun plan with me. For this spread, I'm going to use the Kelova Plan Pastel Floral Sticker Book and also the Pastel Basics, which is just full of pastel boxes and functional stickers. I'll be sure to include my Kelova Plan affiliate link in the description. And I want to use this really pretty little dainty set right here. I also printed and cut on the Cricut this little vintage truck. It's like a pink pickup. And I want to load up the back with some of the florals. So I'm going to go ahead and put that on there first. And I found this truck on Creative Fabrica, which I just found out about from one of my sweet patrons. And I just searched vintage truck. It did have some flowers in it that I didn't want to use because I wanted to use these. So I had to take those out on the Cricut. I just kind of used shapes to sort of slice them out. I think I'm going to put that right here. And I'll also put my affiliate link for Creative Fabrica. It is a bunch of like PNG and SVG files, just about everything you could think of, fonts, images, sets. So I will put that link in there too. And I always appreciate your support when you shop through my links at no extra cost to you. But I do want to go ahead and put some flowers in here, some that aren't too big. I look at it I think this other set goes a little bit better so let's use these these are so pretty too so like I said I just want to load this up in the back with these pretty florals And I'm just going to trim that right around the edge here. Oh, it's so cute. I want a little bit more hanging out there, so I'm going to use one of these. Perfect. All right, now that I got that set, I want to go ahead and do all of my function. Okay, so I want to use one of these over here. Let's do it right here in the middle. And I want a lavender as well. Let's do this. And I just want to make a little cluster. I could do a peach or a green. I think I'm gonna go with the green. And I'm going to do like this darker mint and just trim off the side. And let me see, let me get back to the flowers. Do they have enough blue? I don't think there's enough blue in there to worry with putting a blue box. So let's do up here. It is my son's birthday on the 5th. 
So let's do a, a slender purple box. And a, this is just almost identical to the color of the truck. And let's do this green box. This was a full one, but I cut it down to be just a bit smaller. Okay, and let's do a box over here. In that lighter pink, and I'm just gonna trim it off just like I did that one. And then let's get a box on Sunday. Let's do a purple and a green. I'm gonna do the purple in this size, I think. Yeah, we'll do that there. And this little green one right underneath it. I think that's all I'm gonna do as far as boxes. I don't, I don't know, unless I add one over here. All right, let's go ahead and draw some lines and then I can know where I wanna put everything decorative. All right, let's put some here. I'm gonna put a few down here, and if I end up changing my mind, I can always just put a box here. And then we'll do some here. and a few up here. Okay. All right, I made a few quotes on the Cricut. I made this one that says Fresh Flower Market. And I thought I would do that in this sidebar here. Like it's hanging. Let's see, what else? I just made a few spring quotes. So I'm gonna use this one that says, be happy, I think right here. I think that's so cute. With the little bee. Let's do stop and smell the roses. Right here, and then I'll just leave a little bit of room in case I need to write anything, but I have all of that up there. And let's see what else. How about, all right, spring, do your thing. Right here. And I may use one more small one, but I think I'm gonna stop for now. And I think I need one more box up here. Just, I keep thinking that. So let me go ahead and add one. Just have an even larger cluster. Let's do that. And I 
I think I want to move this quote over here so I can do a quote up here because I don't want one right on top of the other one. Okay, so we're going to do this right here. And then we'll do spring is in the air up here. Okay, perfect. I'm also pulling out spring icons from Kelova Plan. I want to use some of these stickers with. So like this. This would go along with our theme. And then let's try this little wheelbarrow over here. Although I will take the flowers out that are in there because they don't match our flowers. So do a little sticker surgery. Okay, yeah, that worked out great. And we'll just pile in some of those flowers so it will look more like the ones we're using. I think that's gonna work out perfect. I'm just gonna trim this out. like our flowers are in there. So I'm going to add a little bit right here too. And let's put some of these up here so they'll match the flowers or kind of pull it together because there are some different pink flowers there, but they blend. Okay, beautiful. I think I want one more element from here. Let's do We could either do the gloves or we could do this and do our own flowers. Let's do that. Okay, let's do it right here. And we'll just do those just like that. Now we have a little bit of that brownish color over here too. And then let's also go ahead and do the gloves in the sidebar. Kind of, we're kind of going with a flower market theme. Let's do those right there. All right, let's get some flowers on the bottom. I'm not going to do a border all the way across this time, but I just want to add some. We'll put those there. Oh, I like this little birdhouse. Do you think we could do that? How do we think that would look? Let's 
Well, I don't like it there. It's too big or something. So maybe in the sidebar. Let's get a little there. I didn't cut that straight. little bit peeking on the page there. Let's do this little purple butterfly also. With a little bit more right here. And then I think that's all we need for the sidebar. There we go. Just a little bit. Okay, let's get a little bit of more flower action over here. We're about to finish up. And here. like this here. Let's figure something else out. But we can do it right here. Okay, I think I like that sort of coming off that corner. Still don't like this box. And let's get a little scrap here. So let's add a few lavender bullet points. Let's put two up here. And here. Here and here. I think we need one more small quote here and I have this little one that says enjoy the little things. I do have this little watering can I could put some of the some of our flowers in. I think that will fill it out nicely. So let's do those leaves and then we'll put that flower in there and then maybe just one more. Okay, so cute. Have the butterfly kind of flying towards those. All right, let's drop off some flags and black words and we're good to go. Right, let's stick with the lavender like we did for the bullet points. Let's 
put one there and up here and here, and that should be good. And just a few black words. I think it's looking so cute. I love it. Okay, we'll do a today here. And down here, get it done. And let's do to do here. The plan. And we'll have do this right here. And that's going to be my spread. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I put it together. I can't wait to write in it. It's so pretty. I love the colors and the little truck and flowers. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.